Oh, morning everyone. Just thought I'd uh, brighten your day by telling you a couple of jokes. So, uh, as requested by Paul, he says, oh, chuck some out, cheer me up. <clears throat> so I went to Curry's PC World last week. And I went in, and there were uh, rainbow pride flags all over the shop. And I thought, oh, looking all over. And one of the assistants came up to me, and he says, uh, do you like the decor? I says, yep. Yeah. I'm fully supportive of the LG HDTV community. <clears throat> Remember I tried the uh, Curry's PC World? I tried to nick a USB cable by sticking it up my ass. Ended up getting charged. <clears throat> One of my siblings are coming to visit a weekend. She's got no legs. It's my half-sister. <laughs> Just paused it while I went through the lights. So there's a young lad sat at the bottom of the church steps, chucking acid everywhere. <clears throat> and uh, Vicar saw him, he thought, ran down, that's dangerous. So he said to the young lad, chucking acid all over the steps. That's a bit dangerous. He says so. He says, why don't you have this holy water instead? I offered him a bottle of olive water. So the young lad says, what's that going to do? Vicar just says, I put this on the lady's belly and she passed a baby. So the young lad says, well, I put this on my cat's ass and he passed a Ferrari. Oh dear. Just been to home bargains for a few car bits. And uh, I only get my car bits from there. Sometimes I have to nip to court, which is an absolute pile of crap. Has anyone noticed when you go to co-op, there'll be one person in till, and then there's 16 people queuing up. And then you get some fuck with my my French walking past with a tin of baked beans, licking their eyebrows, saying, "Don't worry, she'll be with you in a minute. Just put your fucking beans down and go and help on till." Instead of wondering why there's fucking sixteen people waiting for a loaf of bread, when I got co-op, I have to book a week off work to get a pissing pint of milk. That's why I never got a co-op. That's what I notice the difference between a submarine scanner. And most cold is, when you go to co-op, it's like a submarine scanner. Boo! 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 When you go out it, it's like most cold. Beep, 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 beep. They fire it at 100 miles an hour. Out at the shop in 10 seconds. Oh, got a phone call from the hospital the other day. It says, uh, Mr. Simpson, yeah, yeah. I just want to uh, let you know it's, it's about your mum. I says, what, is she all right? Says, I'm afraid it's the big C. Says, what's happened? Says, it fell off at a sign at co-op and hit her on head. <clears throat> a few weeks ago, I went extreme camping. That was intense. Remember about five years ago, went for a five mile walk past this massive camping ground. Anyway, that was past tense. I thought, I thought about to uh, writing an ebook. I'm going to start doing an ebook on uh, Amazon, but I need to look into doing a job. So I went in library to get a book on self-help, and uh, I went in looking around, I said to the assistant, have you got a book on self-help? She says, well, if I told you, it'd be defeating the object, really, wouldn't it? Anyway, there's a, a coach load of blind people went to Blackpool for a day out. Coach load of blind people. So, driver sends them all up beach, goes into a pub. So, barman says, uh, is that your coach out there? Yeah, yeah, don't worry, we're not staying there. Uh, I've sent all blind lads on beach playing football. I'll have a pipe, please. And barman says, they're blind and they're playing football. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He says, how do they see ball? He says, they don't see it, they can hear it. I've got a football with a bell in it. And, uh, Keeps them happy for a few hours while then they're going somewhere else. But bloke runs in, run into the pub. He says, uh, Is anyone in control of all these blind people on beach? So I says, so Yeah, me, why? He says, They're kicking fuck out at donkeys. So I just thought I'd uh, chuck a few jokes out to cheer you up while I drive back home. I'm back now anyway, so I'll post this. So enjoy him, leave your comments, and I'll speak to you in a bit. See you later, guys.